how many times have you guys gone to your local pharmacy or drugstore or local corner store looking for disinfectant products to only find that they've been sold out or they've run out or they're not going to be restocked for a while. Um, guys, this happens to me literally every week. Uh, you all know that I shop at my local CVS around the corner. I feel like I'm now at the point where I'm trying to figure out which days the delivery truck comes so that I can stock the disinfectant products uh, and make sure I'm one of the first to get them. We know that cleaning and disinfectant uh, supplies these days are in short supply. Obviously, we're in the middle of a COVID pandemic, so many of us are cleaning more than ever, which is a good thing, but it also means that it's sometimes hard to find our trusted products. So first thing I wanted to tell you guys is about a new product that you may not have thought about. It's not a new product, but it's a new product that's been added to the EPA's list of products that is approved to kill SARS-CoV-2 virus, the virus that causes COVID-19. This is a product you may not have thought about. You know about Pine Sol. Um, Pine Sol actually has recently announced that the product specifically, Pine Sol Original Multi-Surface Cleaner, has received approval from the U.S. Uh, EPA Environmental Protection Agency uh, for kill claims against SARS-CoV-2. Again, that's the virus that causes COVID-19. I'm not advocating any particular product, by the way, and I'm not endorsing any products. I'm not getting any money from product companies. Just wanted to let you know. But I'm letting you know this information in case you're like many of us, where you have your go-to products that you're always looking for, whether it's Lysol or Clorox or whatever, and if you don't see it, you're kind of like at a loss as to what to get. Just keep in mind, however, that Pine Sol has been added to this approved list. Um, there are many other products as well, hundreds in fact. Now I know you guys are gonna ask me, okay, so wait, where's the list of products? Like, how do I know which product is on the list? We've talked about this before. I've done videos on other products that have been added to the list, products that you shouldn't get, products that you should get. So I've made a one-stop shop source to help you figure out which products are approved by the EPA to kill SARS-CoV-2 virus. I know you guys are going to ask me what the link is. Make sure you go to the description of this video. I'm going to put the link to the article in the description. If you are watching this video on Facebook Watch, you may need to watch it on my page. I'll also try to put it in the first comment so that you have the link there as well. But the, the link to the article is going to be in uh, the description of the video. I'm going to have in that article a link to the EPA's full list of approved products um, that are approved to kill SARS-CoV-2 virus. So you have that full list and you can search things. In addition, at the, at the bottom or on the back of most um, disinfectant products, there's what we call an EPA registration number. I know you can't see it, but it's way, way down here at the bottom. You can actually search by EPA registration number in that list. In fact, I did that for this very product where I put the number in, I put it into the list and it came up as approved to kill SARS-CoV-2 virus. So you can search by product and see which of the products that you have are um, approved to kill SARS-CoV-2. Uh, the other thing is I've got some resources in that link on how to use disinfectants and cleaning solutions safely. Remember, you never want to mix disinfectants. You don't want to apply heat sources to them. You want to have proper ventilation. You want to make sure they're not expired, but I have some resources in that article too. And finally, segueing a little bit into um, hand sanitizers. Remember, uh, there are some hand sanitizers that the FDA says we should not be using, either because they contain methanol, which is potentially harmful, or they're suboptimal or what have you. I've got um, the list or the link that you can go to to find that list within this article. Once again, I want you guys to go to the description of this video. I'm gonna have the link to the article where you need to search all your products. You can find out what you can use. Um, and I'll also uh, put that in the comments as well. Guys, I hope this is helpful. Please share this video with other people. Also, please subscribe to my channel. I do daily health videos. Guys, um, thank you so much from the bottom of my heart. Uh, I love you. I will see you soon.